Who rules the deepest pits of water? Who, underwater, is a threat to other living species and their kind? Do you have the courage to catch a glimpse of this dangerous species? Swim with us to the deepest bottom of the water. Let's peep into the world of killer whales. Killer whales, also known as orcas, are formidable predators that hunt a variety of prey including fish, seals, and even other whales. These intelligent and social animals use a variety of tactics to locate, isolate, and kill their prey. Overall, killer whales are skilled and efficient predators that use a variety of tactics and techniques to locate and capture their prey. These marine mammals are found in all the world's oceans. They are known for their striking black and white coloration, distinctive dorsal fins, and powerful bodies. Orcas are apex predators, meaning they sit at the top of the food chain and have few natural enemies. They are highly social animals and live in complex societies with different groups specializing in hunting other types of prey. Length and Weight The approximate length of a male killer whale is 33 feet and its weight is nearly 22,000 pounds. An average female orca can be nearly 16 to 19 feet in length and weigh around 3,000 to 8,000 pounds. The largest female killer whale ever found, it measured around 28 feet and weighed 16,500 pounds. Wow, that's heavy. Average age The average age of female orcas is said to be 80 years and these are considered the largest members of the dolphin family. Conversely, males live for 29 years or a maximum of 50 to 60 years. Hunting techniques Killer whales do group hunting techniques and are knowledgeable hunters. Unique methods of killing their prey Killer whales, also known as orcas, are skilled predators that use a variety of tactics and techniques to locate, isolate, and kill their prey. Some of the most common techniques used by killer whales include 1. Vocalizations and echolocation Orcas use vocalizations and echolocation to communicate with one another and locate their prey. They can produce a wide range of vocalizations, including clicks, whistles, and pulsed calls, which they use to communicate with one another and locate their prey. 2. Cooperative Hunting Strategies Killer whales are known for their cooperative hunting strategies, with different members of the group playing different roles in the pursuit and capture of their prey. 3. Wave Washing Orcas will swim in a circle around a group of seals, creating waves that wash the seals off the ice and into the water, where the orcas can more easily catch them. 4. Ramming Orcas may also use their muscular bodies and powerful tails to ram and stun their prey, making it easier to capture and kill. 5. Separating prey from the herd Orcas are known for their ability to single out and isolate individual prey animals from a larger group, making it easier to catch and kill them. 6. The Karate Chop Works on sharks. If we hold a contest named Find the Top Predator, killer whales will win this over sharks, which is considered the largest predator in the world as it has only one natural opponent, the killer whale. However, the shark has the big advantage of having razor-sharp rows of teeth which have the capability of piercing even the thickest inside parts of a whale. 7. Tonic Immobility So, it's risky, but Killer Whale has made it possible by developing a technique. It's clever enough to use its broad tail to push the sharks to the deepest watery surface. After doing this, the Killer Whale crushes the head of the shark by slightly turning and raising its broad tail high in the air. The next plan of action is even more thrilling. Knowing a shark's biological system then sends it to paralyzed mode by flipping over the shark and having an enjoyable meal. 8. The Carousel Works on fish Herring fish are so small that these are not even a bite for killer whales, so it seems worthless to chase them as singles. On the Norwegian coast, killer whales do not allow such bothering to create a hurdle in getting their meals. As they work as a team, they utilize a blend of belly flashes and air bubbles to bring a shoal of fish near a watery surface and then drive them into a clumped up ball. This whipping bait ball is like a revolving carousel which is the cause of this name. The killer whales punch the ball with their broad tail, staggering the fish and they can easily gulp down to reach their stomach as a treat. 9. The Pot Pen Works on Narwhal Invasion of the killer whales is a nature episode and it demonstrates whales incorporating a hunting technique. It had never been documented before in a movie. 
This is possible because killer whales do not easily access narwhals. These are toothed medium-sized whales and they breed in groups in the middle arctic pack ice. Previously, killer whales could not reach their breeding grounds, but now they can approach the area because of the melting sea ice. They can now chase the whole pod of their said prey. They do it in the same formation as wave wash, which triggers the pod to push them into shallow water. Killer whales do not restrict themselves only to hunting and eating animals that are smaller than them. Rather, they tend to attack much bigger sea creatures like humpback, grey, and sometimes blue whales. Killer whales are sometimes called with the name of wolves of the sea. They try the strategy of singling out weak and young prey when they plan to attack large prey. Killer whales wear out whales' fin by biting, pulling, and ramming. After this, they land on the whales' back from the water and disallow the blowhole by splitting the water's surface. Once the chasing is done, they can move on for many hours resulting in the tired huge whale drowning. The killer whale then goes on the next journey of robbing the whales' most beneficial and healthy pieces like its blubber and tongue. They then just leave the rest off for scavengers. 10. The D-Day aka Storming the Beach works on sea lions, elephant seals. The sea lions, which swim off the Atlantic Ocean, take a sigh of breath when they make their way back to the beach. They feel secure as they think killer whales cannot approach them. But when the killer whales modify the shore and grab the sea lions, their faulty sense of security crashes at once. Teamwork wins the championship. As the hunt reaches its climax, the killer whales close in on their prey, their sleek black and white bodies gliding through the water effortlessly. The group works together seamlessly, each member playing a crucial role in pursuing and capturing their quarry. The leading male orca breaks off from the group and charges at the seal, and his powerful jaws open wide as he prepares to strike. The seal tries to make a last ditch escape, but it is no match for the speed and agility of the orca. With a mighty splash, the killer whale snatches the seal in his jaws and drags it beneath the surface where it will be torn apart and shared among the group. The hunt is over and the killer whales have successfully secured their next meal. Their coordinated and efficient hunting strategies once again prove their status as the ocean's apex predators. Behavior in Captivity If they are kept or trapped, they behave quite differently. Attack on Humans Tilikum was a killer whale known as a captive killer whale that lived in SeaWorld Orlando for most of his life. It was caught when it was 2 years old. Two more young killer whales are also caught with it. It is said to be the largest killer whale in captivity, weighing about 12,500 pounds and its length was 22.5 feet. The length of the fins was 7 feet. Their attacks on humans are rare and these are observed in aquariums and zoos. They were found to be involved in 3 fatal attacks out of 4. Two of them were trainers and a man who gave unlawful entry into SeaWorld Orlando. How to stop them from being extinct? 1. We must try to eat sustainable seafood. 2. Avoid using plastic bags. 3. We should adopt natural ways of cleaning. 4. A political action has to be taken for not following the rules. Killer whales are skilled and efficient predators that use a variety of tactics to locate, isolate, and kill their prey. They have gotten their nickname Killer Whale for a reason since they are at the top of the food chain and are also one of the smartest animals of the world. Do tell us in the comments section if you have enjoyed the video about Arcas, the most prominent member of the dolphin family. Subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for the most exciting updates from the animal kingdom. Till then, happy YouTubing!